now. A number of countries went to the polls at the weekend in what's been described as a Super Sunday across the continent. Well, let's take a look at the results and projections that we know so far. Benin has a new president. Patrice Talon won in a runoff election that saw his main rival concede defeat. The incumbent Prime Minister Lionel Zinsou phoned Mr. Talon to congratulate him on his victory. Congo Brazzaville, Niger, Senegal, Cape Verde and Zanzibar were all exercising their democratic rights too. So let's head to Zanzibar next where the incumbent president has been declared leader in a contest where the opposition called for a boycott. BBC Africa's Tulanana Bohela has more. Dr. Ali Mohamed Chain has just been declared the winner of the rerun election here in Zanzibar, taking more than 200,000 votes. In his acceptance speech, he said that he was thankful to those that voted for him and those that did not, simply implying to the supporters of the opposition party, the main opposition party, CUF, that boycotted this rerun election. Just after receiving his certificate, the president-elect, speaking to journalists, said that working with the CUF party would depend depend on what happens next and this maybe leaves doors open as to whether there will be more amicable relationships between the main party CCM and other opposition parties. The next five years for Zanzibar now lie in his hands in which he said he hopes for more prosperity and nation building. The people of Zanzibar themselves hope to get back to their normal lives after what has been almost six months of tense anxiety in the political gridlock.